so I just want to do a TLDR part for this video, just in case people just want to not watch the video and just want to get the here. Here's what here's what happening, but like short term, so you don't have to watch the video because if you don't want to, because this video is like it's it's a Blair White video, like holy fuck, of course it's gonna be a long one. Uh, so TLDR is uh, Blair White just wants to harass people for being trans and you know whatever you know whatever kind of fetish thing they do or whatnot and say well you're ruining the trans community because you exist even st like instead of just going it's just weird like weird people are what makes the community get laughed at and she just tries to say this will destroy the community it's such a travesty these people are awful and horrible human beings because they have a fetish like it's weird like i can laugh at it a little bit when i hear stuff like bio dog like Without context, that just kind of sounds dumb. But with all these things, uh, Blair is just wrong. She just wants to harass and complain about people, but doesn't actually want to own them to the criticism. Of. She just wants to make fun of people. Like, if you're if you're honest about what you're doing, at, at least be honest about it. Because Blair is not even teaching us anything about these videos because she pulls up the attack helicopter defense. But that video was kind of, that, that part of the video was dumb because hear me out. That entire argument is based around people going trans people shouldn't exist because all these surgeries, you should blah, 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 insert insult here because helicopter, blah, blah, blah. It's just it's just meaningless nonsense because I, I look, I'm not here to defend these people. I'm just here to say just don't be Blair White and harass these people because they're doing their own thing. I don't give a fuck if it's on Snapchat or whatever. Ignore it and move on. That is the most simple answer because... And I need to say this. No one else in the trans community is losing their mind over it. So that was a TLDR. You're not going to see the rest. You're not going to see all the content unless you look at it the right way. You know what? Hello, PETA? <clears throat> oh, Blair White's doing this shit again. Like... Did did she not learn from fucking lying about like every one hundred percent of everything that we've already talked about? <sighs> All right, let's just jump into fucking fucking zero submission because I'm, I'm just gonna give you the TLDR. <clears throat> Blair's taking all these videos and people to go, hey, this one person represents the entire community of trans people or anybody that's LGBT because Blair is doing that dumb shit again, even though it got her in trouble not too long ago and she lost. A million, um, I need to say this, she lost a million subs because of her lying and being dishonest. But if you watch any of her videos, and I need you to hear this, Blair usually doesn't even link or or even show the full videos of whatever she's talking about. So this could all be just like some bullshit where she's not even being honest. And it's, it's just like some weird person doing role play or, or some shit. I don't fucking care because Blair's not honest. Like, come on. We already know what happened with fucking Janae and Janae Marie Croc. Uh, that shit was egregious. And people were like, Blair, what the fuck? Even her fans were like, what the fuck, Blair? Like, when you, the person who lies, is going, hey, guys, hear me out. I'm going to do the same thing. But with this guy. And I, this is just what she does in general. Like, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. This video is just it's, it's just going to be Blair lying or she's going to be trying to take clips out of context or maybe she's just going to try and say, but this represents all the LGBT, even though it's just one person just being weird. Like, come on. Come on now. If that was the case, then the LGBT wouldn't exist. Like, you wouldn't exist, Blair. Like, come on. If one person, would, if, if you're applying that one person ruins it for all, then by that logic then the LGBT people wouldn't even exist to begin with, even being able to have even any amount of rights at this this point in time because all these dumb people run around. But that's not the case. And it just it just makes me tired because I know when I go in this video, it's just going to be more dumb shit. It's my main channel. It's beginning to look a lot like a Blair White Christmas. Christmas is my favorite holiday. I know that a lot of people suffer from seasonal depression and get really down around the holiday time. But for me, you know, I suffer from like always depression with the exception of Christmas and December. It's like December 1st hits and 
I'm in an amazing mood, even though this year has been... Anyways, <laughs> but yeah, what are you guys getting me for Christmas? <laughs> Every single one of you is getting me a present this year, right? Okay, I'll wait, I'll wait. You're right, I'm not gonna spoil it. <laughs> so last night I was in bed with my fiance and we were both on our phones and he said, Blair, there's some trans stuff going viral and trending on the Snapchat front page. And I was like, at first skeptical, of course, because any trans stuff that Joe is watching is really not gonna be something I would wanna watch. That's really his private time. But anyway, so I'm like, okay, I'll look. And I open my phone and the first thing I see is my partner identifies as a dog right there on the front page for millions to see. But you know, because it is the holiday season and I am working on, you know, just being a little more joyful, a little less judgmental, a little more open-hearted and open-minded, I decided to give it a chance and check it out. But I also wanted you guys to watch it with me. So let's watch it. Oh, I'll just give you the TLDR. What Blair meant to say was, I saw this video with trans people, but to avoid getting in too much trouble for being wrong and probably taking clips out of context, et cetera, et cetera, and basically saying, look at this person, look at how dumb they are, so I can do all this and basically do the same process I did that blew up in my face because I, I did it on a person who's actually popular and actually is pretty well known by people. So I'm gonna look at this small person on, on Snapchat or whatever and cause another possible, I say possible, because Blair has found herself in so many controversies where she's just gotten away outside of Janae, where she just got away. It just, people just like, fuck. But like, this is the way I, I, I see this and I just go, why would you repeat the thing that got you in trouble in the first place? Why? Why would you do that? that that's the question I ask. Like, come on now. Come on now. Ask yourself, how many of you? I'm gonna watch a Blair White video, and, and I need to. I mean, tell me this right to my face. After seeing her do something that blew up in her face, how many of you are gonna look at her and be like, "Why are you doing the same thing? Why are you doing something that's gonna ultimately hurt you in the end?" And and I'm not trying to be mean, but we all know what Blair's going to do because if you've watched any of my videos, Blair's just dishonest, and with a simple Google search for at least majority of the shit. You, you can prove it wrong. Like, a simple Google search proves at least half of what Blair Wright is saying wrong. Because Blair most likely saw this video and went to damage control just in case people actually researched. Because, yes, this person probably has some some nonsense where it's like a joke or something. I, I, I just can't care. Like, I already know it's going to be wrong. It's it's like foresight. Like, when I put like in some of my videos, I predicted what Blair's gonna say next because I, I just know the bullshit she's gonna fucking say. Like, I know at least half the bullshit a lot of the people who are like, oh, this thing or that thing. And I'm just like, I've seen enough of your videos to put down like 95% of what you will say. And I'm just gonna take a guess. Blair's gonna look at it. She's gonna do it. Like, she, what she did in the intro is it's gonna be a whole bunch of that, but like. Oh, wow, look at this fucking crazy person. Yada, yada, yada. Like, I know the drill at this point. And it just makes me tired. Because I know people don't like the commentary videos where I, I commentate. But I eventually, and I mean this, I will eventually get back to doing the good shit. Yes, I will do the, the classic. Looking at history like a champ. Uh, but in all seriousness, I think we can all learn... One thing, and that's just never watch a player waste content. <laughs> I'm so mean, but it's true. Like there are plenty of people who who saw Blair right and said, "Oh, she's a nice lass," and then then went back a few years later and said, "Fuck, I was I was a fan of a villain, and I was the good guy who didn't even know it." All right, let's go. The thing I know about this before watching it is that this is a trans man who is also a trans dog. If you think I'm saying this to make fun of this person, that is not the case. This is literally how this person describes themselves. A trans man who also identifies as a dog. 2020, what's good? Bella, look, it's your cousin. <coughs> Sorry, okay. She does not claim him. Imagine if the easiest way to delight your wife is you just throw a ball across the room. Relationships wouldn't fail anymore if that's all you had to do. You're Tony. I don't even know what I'm getting myself into watching this shit. I'm 
beautiful Los Angeles. Of course it takes place here. You know, maybe I'll run into this person on my morning jog. Dog. This dog. On my morning jogs. People come to my house and they see my ribbons and they say, oh, you've won all these ribbons at dog shows. But they rarely ask if I'm the dog. Yes, because that's a natural question. Someone would ask, are you the dog? Are you? <laughs> I'm just, I'm just, I, 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 I look, I, I can enjoy this video on my own time. But looking at, looking at this with a critical eye, no, no. Blair, Blair just wants to make fun of people and say, hey, ha ha, dog, look, look at how bad this is. This is bad. Trans community, why, why, why we make him dog? Why we do that? And that's, that's just the gist. Like, I, like, by itself, this video is, is like something you can laugh at because it's dumb. But like, come on. Like, we all know he didn't compete in the fucking dog tournament. He, he fucking brought his own dog. Like, whatever he does with his partner or, or, or whatever shit they do. It's weird, but it's not my fucking business. <sighs> Jesus Christ, I feel I feel old. So I'm just I'm just gonna give you the TLDR what Blair meant uh, by jog. It's fucking because people because people walk their dog. You know, the, he he's jogging like the dog. It's, it's just so bad. Like it's not even like funny bad. It's not like, like where I see a Chuck of Conroy video and go, all right, that was fucking funny, but I fucking hate the pun. Because it works. It's something you won't expect. But but this was just like, hey, 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 ha, ha, hey, ho, ho. Like, bruh. 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 This is the bruh moment. I just, I'm so tired. I want to get to the actual video I wanted to make. But I, I got to sit through this. Because I'm a, I'm a fucking old ass, ass old person. I've won quite a few. Um, this is the High Point Award for Puppy Palooza, and then these two are the best ones I have because these are my two best in shows. I got these at DomCon. Oh my god, it's a whole thing. <laughs> my name is Tony, and I'm a human pup. I'm Andrew. I'm Tony's husband and trainer. Pet play. No. They have actual dogs. No. <laughs> Why they have to have actual dogs? I, I'm. A, it's okay that that makes me feel uncomfortable, right? Like, you know what? Hello, Peta. Pet play is any time that a person takes on the role of. A I know. I, I I fucking know people don't like my commentary videos because they're. Their, their commentary videos and every, anyone can do that you just pull up your camera and be like you're wrong that that's it but Blair's fucking wrong <laughs> like holy shit what's the, like really you're gonna turn this into another thing where you're dumb because guys if I go over all the Blair White shit do, do I really have to go over but Blair's just being an asshole like I, I, under, I understand that this shit is kind of weird and I, I'm I'm not I'm not for it either but at least I'm just gonna be like that was weird, and I, I fucking move on with my day. I don't make a 10-minute video to say, yo, look at this weirdo here. Make Basically do what I did last time with harassments and yada yada. Because Blair fucks up so much. Like, so much. Like, so so much with her, so much with her videos. God. Jesus. Uh, but let me, let me, let me, let me sum it up. This person owns dogs, and what, is, is Blair implying, oh, they're going to fuck their dog or something like that? I just, it's so dumb. Like, I, I don't like shit, but at least I just go, it's weird and move on. That's, that's just the gist of the video. That, God, I, I hate this video so much. It's just boring. There's nothing here other than either Blair's going to turn us into something like, oh, this is, this is how it affects the community of trans people just because to boost her ego or some shit. Or it's just going to be Blair going, hee hee, ha ha look weirdo and that's the entire video and it doesn't really do anything it's just it's just an, it's just kind of obnoxious because Blair was just like how do I make views off of dumb people and, and it's just and it's just like I can't like I, I love making fun of dumb people I mean I, look hear me out the internet's full of dumb people but I think we'll be fine 
I can't even bother. So let's keep going because I want to finish this and get back to the good shit that you've been waiting for. Emulate that animal, either through their behavior or their actions. Um, some people wear costumes. This is the first hood that I ever got. I've been involved in pet play for my entire life. Uh, a lot of kids like to play pretend. They like to pretend to be an animal and they enjoy doing it. I just never grew out of that. I got into pet play through Tony. Once we started dating, a uh, handler is a common role for human pups and I was glad to do it. They say when the student is ready, the master appears. So this is a fetish, right? I feel like I'm always asking that on this channel. I feel like I'm always reacting to and watching like really, really out there shit. And my only reaction is just, this is a fetish. Am I wrong? So I'm not gonna lie. It has me really effed up that they keep talking about pup play, puppy play, pet play, and showing the dogs, like the actual dogs. Like maybe not even PETA. Maybe I should call the police. Wait, are they defunded? The first time I met you, I was dressed as a dog for Halloween. You are, are you comfortable being uh, fully out? I don't care. He was uh, his female at the time. I remember that he showed up with a little like dog nose painted on. Yeah, it didn't seem weird at the time. I just happened to have all the gear. Well, that's sh uncomfortable. Here's the thing, fetishes are okay, right? Fetishes are clearly okay. Preferably in the privacy of your bedroom, not like all up on trending on Snapchat, let's say that first. And it's only okay as long as those actual dogs are not involved, okay? I, I'm not gonna assume they are. Can you read me a bedtime story? Well, I don't wanna go to bed. Mom said we needed... Like that? Hey. Okay, kids, time to get up and eat. It's time for bed, babe. Good night, Shelby. Hi, my name is Shelby Counterman. I am nine years old and I collect cockroaches. Uh, so the clip I fucking showed you is worse than anything Blair is complaining about. Uh, so why did I show you it? Because that's worse than people dressing up like fucking dogs and playing with their partner. Or maybe it's just walking their dog and whatnot. Like, I don't fucking, I don't fucking know. Like, I don't know what puppy play or whatever it is. Like, does it bother me? Yeah, but I don't really give a shit. I don't go around harassing people or going... Oh, you should fucking stop. I'm just going to be like, oh, that's weird and move on. But but Blair's saying this is like the worst on the planet. What I just showed you is people who who have fucking houses full of roaches. And I'm just like, right, call the exterminator. No, no, no. Call the exterminator. Uh, and by the way, Blair never talks about like weird shit like that. When she, when she could be doing that shit instead of doing dumb shit like this. Like, bruh. I feel like someone dressing up as a dog for some weird fetish shit isn't that much of an issue compared to someone having a fucking house full of roaches. Like, what? How, how is one not worse than the other here? I want y'all to think about that for five minutes. Would y'all really want a house full of fucking roaches infesting your house and probably in your food and fr- Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> no. No, you wouldn't. Would you want someone to dress up as a dog and making you feel uncomfortable? Yeah, probably. You're probably a weird person. I mean, there, there's so much weird people. There are people who get turned on by vomiting. I'm just like, whoa, time to fucking leave. <laughs> like, bruh. What, what she's telling me is Blair's more scared of people doing stuff in the, in the, in the business of their own home and not really doing much because... I, I guess they just do it, like, in their house, like, their backyard and whatnot. Maybe they do it in public, but not to, like, a degree where it's, like, fetishy. I, I guess it's just weird. I don't fuck it. I just can't. This, is, this video is so dumb. I'm gonna pray they aren't. But, like, the way this is all presented is the actual issue for me. The identify as a dog thing. I identify as a man and also as a dog thing. Like... 
It makes a mockery of actual trans people and y'all don't need me to even tell you that. Like, y'all know. This perfectly feeds into the millions of people on social media. Just search up the terms I identify as. Just, it's like a big joke. Like, it's a joke. Like, I identify as a helicopter. I identify as this f You know, Blair said something stupid back there. I wonder if you, I'm just going to fucking tell you uh, when she's brought up, I identify as a attack helicopter was a joke about the fact that trans women and trans men to ident identify as female and male. Oh, if you identify as this gender, well, I guess I'm a helicopter. Like at this point, Blair, does it matter if somebody says they're a fucking dog? It's 1% of people who would be like, oh, I'm trans, but hey, also a dog or whatever. Like, fine. It's stupid. And how many other people have made stupid shit up in the entire world? A lot. But I, I actually can't count. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Like, I, I looked up the dumbest inventions in the world, and I was just like, how the, f how the fuck did we fuck up so bad? <laughs> like, some of the, some airplanes are fucking bougie garbage. Like, we've made so many fuck-ups in our life. Like, I think we made the backyard bomb, which was, was canceled, because uh, imagine dropping a bomb that would kill everybody. Just from dropping in your backyard sounds terrifying. Just the fact that America has a bomb at one point where if I dropped it in your backyard, everyone would die. You're, you're f fucking everywhere. Gone. You took a shit, gone. You, you washed your hands, you, gone. Water, gone. The earth, gone. The moon, <laughs> fucking doesn't even exist, bitch. <laughs> the sun, what the fuck is light anymore when there's only darkness? I don't fucking. <laughs> I don't. I don't know why that's the first. I'm fucking tired. It's twelve o'clock. Like it's twelve thirty. I think. God. But I'm serious. A lot of what Blair is saying is just kind of bougie garbage. And I knew she was gonna bring up trans people and be like, "Oh, it affects the trans people." No, it doesn't. If it affected trans people, then you would see so many trans people actually going out of their way to go, don't fucking do this. Stop being stupid. Everyone just kind of ignores it because, yo, know, people are just fucking weird. There's a whole bunch of people who do weird shit. Hell, there are gay people who say, I fucking identify as a fish. Like, bruh. 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 Like, like, come on. Come on now, gang. Like, how many, how many of you hear dumb shit? From anyone, uh, hell, I'll see straight people say dumb shit, like, all the time. And I'm just like, and? <laughs> Doesn't bother me. That's that's the point. That's the point of life. Is If something bothers you, you, you ask yourself, why does this bother me? Is it because it's actually dumb? Like, when people ask me how do I feel about bi lesbians, I'm just like, how does that work? It's not even, like, me trying to be an ass. It's more of... How does that specifically work? Because you're not attracted to men at all. You're only attracted to girls, so technically you'd still just be a lesbian because you're not attracted to, like, men. And if you say trans men, that's just saying that they're women, and that doesn't make sense either. And being attracted to trans women doesn't really make them men. They're still technically women, so by that logic, they would, you'd still be a fucking lesbian. Uh, but at least I have an excuse for mine. It's an actual question where you're just like, this thing might be a fetish. It might just be like people just doing role play and it's not really sexual. It's just like, oh, they, they were a dog something. I don't fucking care. But like mine's an actual question where you're just like, why do they do this? Why? When you have the answer. Where mine is more of how does this work and why does it even exist if it doesn't make sense? Yours is just, hey, this thing, here's why this works and why it does also, why does it why does it exist? That's the gist of the entire thing. So I'm gonna I'm gonna tough it out. What the fuck? Oh no, he oh no, it got out again. Fucking fucking hate hamsters. Identify as this hairbrush. And it adds such an extra layer that the person is actually, you know, a trans man supposedly. Like, why are you equating like why are you doing that? You're blurring lines that I would prefer not to be blurred. It's like identifying as another gender. It's like, okay, whether you like it, understand it or not, there is a scientific precedent for it. There is like, we observe this, you know, some people are naturally in the population going to struggle with issues of gender dysphoria. Identifying as a dog though, I just like, 
to leap from that to oh, also identify as a dog. The audacity. Like, it's really the audacity for me. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, hmm. I'm just gonna say this. I think the fact that Blair says the audacity, like, how dare you exist? How dare you do something that's not normal? Like, that's just the, like, come on. Like, if people, if I have to point this out and people agree with me, that's, that's how you know it's kind of fucked that Blair gets away with this shit constantly. Like, the minute she was like, oh, supposedly they're trans. What she's trying to say is, I hope they're not. And they're just a weirdo who likes dog fetish and whatever. And I'm just like, all right, do your fucking thing, you weirdo. Because Blair is just weirder. Why do you have to mind someone's business to such a degree? And I, I know someone's going to bring up, but it's on Snapchat. I know it's on Snapchat. It will not. But if you go to the extent to say, look at how weird it is. Oh, yeah, there are fucking travesties in my community because they exist and they're not really doing anything. They're just weird people on the Internet, like half of the fucking Internet. There are so much weird people on the Internet. You could make a documentary that would exist to the fucking ends of the fucking universe. And everyone would be like, no, that seems about right. Uh, Like, come on, come on, like, bruh, this is a bruh moment. This this is a cringe moment. This is a moment fuck my forehead is bleeding i'm going to die now i'm just gonna i'm just gonna i'm gonna bleed out i'm fucking joking by the way i won't die on on camera i'll, I'll die off screen like like a true chat like like the the ultimate gamer <laughs> fucking blair white is just so bad i'm hoping i can get through this as quickly as possible but knowing my videos <laughs> with blair white <laughs> my fucking older audience just looks at these videos and goes Oh man, you knew who she go goes and look at the the comments like why is it so long? Oh, you're new, aren't you? <laughs> All the oldies. Ah, uh, you, you didn't expect the Blair White video that's an hour long, did you? Fucking, I I remember the fucking um, you fucking the fucking bleach video by Super iPad Wolf was gonna be two hours, but I was like, no, please for the love of God, I'm gonna. Go to the part where I know he finishes doing the dumb shit. <laughs> uh, of telling us, basically, I was wrong here. Look at this first part. But this second part, all of it, I don't like it. <laughs> like, bruh. Bruh. All right, let's move on. Because cause I've wasted your time. And I want to get through this fast. Restrictive or restraining. For example, leashes, harnesses, uh, mitts on your hands. This is called a show tail. What I've done is I've put it through a harness and then I just wear the harness backwards and that gives the tail better balance and as you can see that's rubber silicone tail so it wags and then the most important part of all of this gear is actually this guy the ball that's the most important part yeah I mean that makes sense like dogs love their toys they have me making sense of it now help me that's it my responsibility is similar to the responsibility with a regular dog. The first I'm ex dog. Mm -hmm. I'm a regular dog. I'm just different. Okay. We have bio dogs, and I do train them because no barking. Bio dog. He just said bio dog. He said bio dog in the same way that I say like. <sighs> I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna start this out. I, I, I knew what Blair was going to say. She's going to say bio, bio women. Because Blair says bio women. Like, oh, only, only these women are biological. Blah, blah, blah. I, I'm kind of, I'm just, I'm so used to a Blair White video that I just want to skip and just take out the, just show you all the dumb shit at this point. But I know if I do that, I'm not going to be genuine. I'm just going to take all the bad clips. I'm just going to let you play it out so you can look at how bad it is. Because that's how it be. But hear me out. <clears throat> bio Broly. <laughs> oh my god I pulled out the most shad technique under my belt bio broly bio 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 broly bio 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 broly bio broly bio broly I don't know why I'm saying bio broly so much it was not a good movie I at least enjoyed the second one like I, I know we get mad at the pissing because yeah I mean can we make the joke he was pissing on the moon. I can't. I can't do it. I'm tired. I'm tired. He was pissing on the moon. The moon. Uh. 
I mean, everything's bio-organic, right? <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing here. We're going to fucking move on. But Blair is just like, hey, look, look at how I, I, say, I say all that shit. <laughs> fucking bio. Bio dog sounds like a real fucking... Mo- God damn, I'm going to have to write this shit down. I'm legitimately going to put bio dogs. Ah, uh, yes. The most in- ingenuity I've ever come up with. Scaling real life. Uh, <laughs> I can't. I don't know why that's the first thing. Like, just, just bio dogs. <laughs> it's fucking, damn it. Damn it, I didn't expect it. That's why it's so much more funny. Just, come on. It's just me. It's just, you know, it's, it's uh, I can't. That, that one got me. Damn it. Uh, I fucking, I can't. But I'm, I'm still being honest that Blair is still wrong. Because she just wants to harass and say, look, if you, if you do anything that's not normal... That means you're going to ruin the entire community. You're a fucking monster. What a horrid human being. That's what she does. She's like, oh, you're a fucking shit human being because you do weird shit. And and you don't actually do it in public or whatever. I don't fucking know. Like, I'm just so tired. But I'm also trying to not laugh because, like, like I, I find some of the stuff weird and, and funny. But, like, does that mean that I should go disrespect these people like Blair is? No. I can still find things funny and keep it to myself. It's not it's not a thing of, oh, I need to be an asshole about it. Like if I find some parts like funny, it's gonna be like <clears throat> and then move on. Like it's not a, it's not my business. I, I don't fucking care. But like guys, hear me up. Don't be an asshole to people in their face or an asshole to a large public audience. Like, fine, I laughed at bio dogs because that is funny. Like you could have just said I'm just I'm just like a human dog or something. That would, have, that would have gotten your point across without it sounding so goofy. But for Blair, she's just trying to say, but that's how I call, you know, the difference between cis women and all that shit. I'm just like, move on, please. All right, let's keep going because I'm dying on the inside. Don't do that. I can't. I can't. <laughs> So I hang out and I provide him with lots of attention and tell him he's a good boy. I am. That's basically 90% of it. I am a good boy. (laughs) Hey! Hey, Hi, Sophia! Come on in! Y'all hear him bark when the door opened, though? I need a cigarette, and I don't even smoke. (laughs) You're so cute. I know. I don't know if I can continue. This was a bad idea. I have a question. Yes. Do you, what sends you into puppy space? Like when you put on these two things or one thing? For me, it's being on all fours. The gear is I don't need the gear. The gear is for you to see me as a dog. Okay. So I don't need the actually gear. Actually, getting down on all fours, that's it. You're gone. Yeah. We don't make it sexual, but I have nothing against those who do. That's great. But more power to those who do. <laughs> I thought it was a fetish. Now I, do, now I don't even know. I don't even know. <laughs> oh fuck I'm choking on her bullshit because she's not paying attention what the person is trying to say or what she's failing to pay attention to is <clears throat> hey other people do it as a fetish but we do it just for like fun we don't do it like to fuck like that that's the fucking shit did you not get it the one dude's like oh other people do it like as a fetish but I'm like he's like guys we I don't I don't fuck her when she's a dog please <laughs> he's just, he had that face like do I have to really explain the obvious? Like, he, he, that's like the face. He had the face of the guy who's like, 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 come on, come on now. That That's like the face. That was like the embodiment of like, come on, really? Like, even he had to sit down and go, guys, we don't, we don't do that shit in bed. Like, that's how you know you fucked up when, when, when I can just, if I, if I go back and pause, you just see that face and you see his face and he's just like, like the most. The most sad face I've ever seen. Like he's just like, guys, we, we don't we don't do that. Like he 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 knew people were gonna look at him like, does he fuck her as a dog? 
Do they like, do, they, do, they do the bork? The bork, bork? Like, it's just that face. That face embodies, like, everything that is with that video. And it's just like, no. It's, it's the stop meme. Stop! And you're just like, that. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm losing my fucking mind. But it's true. Like it's the meme. Like it's the, it's the stop meme. It's just like, oh, that that's that's the thing. I can't. I can't. I'm tired. But like, but like, you know, all seriousness. As I joke about, I joke about it. As I go and kill this spider. Uh, I can tell you, like, 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 as much as I'm joking about the guy's face, like, it is true. Like, he's like, I don't, I don't, we don't fuck when she's doing dog shit. <laughs> that's, that's like, that, like, Blair did not pay attention. Like, oh, other people do it as a fetish, but we don't do that. That's the entire, how do you not pay attention? I'm, I'm so tired. I'm so tired, but that got, like, a chuckle out of me with his face. Bella just walked by. I can't even look at her. I cannot even look at her. Belle, go away. Go away. I can't. I can't. Ugh. Bio dogs, am I right? My family, for example. I think they have a general idea that I'm into some kinky stuff, but we don't talk about it. Didn't y'all just say it wasn't sexual? And now it's kinky? Now you're calling it a kink? <sighs> at this point, just own it, okay? You're getting... I didn't know I had to go down this rabbit hole one day, and especially in a Blair White video. But here we go. Here we go. I, I can't even do the Mario voice. My my voice is in so much pain. Yahoo! I'm tired. Fucking kill me. Uh, let's let's just go, let's just let's just get over with. Uh, there are people who do kinky things that are considered kinky and whatnot. It's like oh, like she she thinks you know she knows people think it's kinky. She's like yeah, it, it's kinky and all that shit. But it's like not they don't fuck doing that shit it's like oh it's it's kinky but it's not kinky it's 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 it's, it's kind of like you know how cosplay is a thing right how people have you know cosplay is a fetish like that uh so think that but it's not kinky like yeah you it's either kinky or kinky or not kinky depending on how you see it at the moment in time like oh you did a cosplay for fun or maybe you're doing it to be kinky this time like blair the fuck is wrong with you? Like, the fact that I have to go down and pull up the the smart man. The the simple example is depressing. I'm just I'm just I'm just losing my mind. Rocks off. It is what it is. You're already up on TV barking and shit. like just own it at this point, please. I think everyone should try it once, and if they like it, they should try it a second time. Yeah, no, I think I'll find a different hobby, dude, like knitting or torturing myself online, watching content like this. All right, guys, that is it. I mean, it's not, this isn't it, sis, but it's it for the video. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel as well as my side channel, Blair Black. Make <coughs> uh, let, let me just give you the, the fucking drill kill. Uh, I'm just, I'm just going to tell you right now. This video was lazy as fuck. Not even not, not even just my part. It's just Blair in general. <laughs> Fucking like like the fact that I, I have to I explain or just sit there and go, all right. Like Blair's videos are so simple to break apart and just look at it and go, you're wrong. You're wrong. Oh, this is why you're wrong. Oh, you're very wrong. And you need to get the fuck out of this house. <laughs> that's that's the entire that's the Blair White formula is wrong wrong get the fuck out because you're really wrong <laughs> oh my god i'm so tired you know what i'm gonna do a tldr part so people will be like oh i get it now <laughs>